Good morning, everyone. Welcome into North Dakota today on our Wish Wednesday. Philanthropy can begin at any age. And today, local fundraiser Miss Aurora, her mother Melody, and local chapter CEO Billy Joe are here with us to share how youth can make a difference in the lives of other kids in need in the community. Good morning, everybody. Good, Good morning. morning. It is a Make-A-Wish Wednesday party here <laughs> on the blue couch. Of course, we're in theme here. Hi, Miss Aurora. Hi. How old are you? 11 years old. 11 years old, huh? And already running a business. Do you want to tell us about what you've been up to? So basically, I've been doing lemonade stands and okay. hot chocolate stands and many more. Whoa. Okay, so when did this all start for you? What grade were you in? It all started in first grade and I was doing coins for wishes. Coins for wishes, okay. And mom, Melody, what are you thinking about all of this? Oh, I'm very proud of her and she works hard to help other kids. She mm. likes to be a giver. I love that. And you've already been on the radio a few times, spreading awareness, giving interviews. You're a rock star. <laughs> yeah. You're a professional, huh? Yeah, I oh. guess you could say that. I guess, I guess, a bit. So <laughs> when does school start up for you? Uh, next Tuesday. So you've been a busy gal this summer? Yeah. OK. Should we check in with Billy Joe to see yeah. how things are going over well, at that? And end? winter. What's kind of fun is she doesn't she doesn't let the fundraising stop just because the winter comes. Uh, she actually does hot chocolate stands yeah. as well, and sometimes okay. drags her little brother along with, don't you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so it's a family business yeah. I'm hearing about. Yeah, it's well, cool. I just think it's awesome. You can see it's not only number one; it gives her joy and gives her purpose, and it makes her feel good about giving to other kids. Yeah. And I think that's great. Number two, she gets to help give joy to other kids. <laughs> and so we're just so grateful that she has contributed over the years since first grade um, mm -hmm. to helping wishes in North Dakota come true. Uh, you know what? You're doing such big things for such a tiny little girl here. <laughs> so why was this so important for you? It's so important to me because I love helping kids and make their dreams come true. Yeah, that's, that's pretty special, huh? Yeah. So when you head back to the school year, back to the classroom, are you going to be maybe talking with some students, some parents, and maybe kind of, you know, getting the lay of the land there too? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> maybe some teachers would want to help. Yeah. We, this is kind of an all hands on deck thing. Yeah. Okay, so how do we get a hold of you? What if we would like to get some hot cocoa or get some lemonade? Uh, I'll be at, um, in Wapiton, North Dakota at okay. 207 11th Street North. Wow, okay, we've got the business set up. Yes, <laughs> and lemonade stands, hot cocoa stands, yeah. whatever it is, coins for wishes yeah. in your school. There's wish weeks across the state where they have spirit weeks, weeks that uh, at the end of the week they, they do different fundraisers and uh, grant wishes that way. There are different ways that you can get involved and you can always contact us at wish.org slash North Dakota or 701-280-9474. Okay, Miss Aurora, a little birdie told me you might have a surprise for Miss Billy over there. Mm -hmm. Do we want to kind of tell us what's going on? Okay, so basically recently I had a lemonade stand and I have a bag for you. You have a donation? Yes. $48.50. Oh my god! <laughs> that is amazing. This Thank you so, so much. Special. That's going to boost somebody's wish. Thank you so oh, much. Oh, that is so <laughs> sweet. And to witness it here with you guys, I feel like we're at the gala. <laughs> Little sweet surprises like this are always happening with this organization, and it makes it truly so special to witness it. That is so wonderful. <laughs> How do you feel about that just now? Good. Yeah. <laughs> Feels, you're like, this is what I'm doing anyway. It doesn't feel like that big of a deal, huh? <laughs> okay, so for folks at home who may not realize, what does this really do to the mission, to what you guys are doing, and to the wishes you're making come true? Yeah, so as you know, hopefully, we get the privilege of creating life-changing wishes for children with critical illnesses. Yeah. And not all children are healthy and able to go to school next week or right. be in sports, etc., because they're in treatments or mm -hmm. they're undergoing surgeries or whatever it may be. And so the impact is you get to help us say yes to those kids and help them think about if you had a wish, what would it be? And that's pretty magical of what you get to do through us. So we appreciate you so very much, Aurora, and having your mom, Melody, share you with us. <laughs> yes, a working girl already. Well, thank you guys so much for coming on. Yeah, thank you for having us. Thank you. This has been so sweet. I'm so excited for you in your new school year. You are such a rock star, Miss Aurora. <laughs> and of course, a neat way for kids to learn how to give back in general. You can always think of Make-A-Wish North Dakota. Thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
All right, happy Wish Wednesday, everybody. Stick around. We have plenty more coming up here on North Dakota Today after the break. Ha, ha, ha.